10-year-old boy with autism getting handcuffed in his own school. Police say the boy had been misbehaving and posed a threat to himself and others. RT's Trinity Chavez reports. A North Texas school district is under fire after the release of body camera video showing a 10-year-old with autism being handcuffed. The video may disturb some viewers. The newly released video shows a three-hour incident that happened back in April at Alexander Elementary School with a resource officer and a 10-year-old student. Police and teachers say that the 10-year-old Thomas Brown was poking other students and refusing to listen. Do you want help? Uh -huh. The video shows the 10 year old being carried to another room. Nope. We're back to where we were the other day. You can hear him screaming. <laughs> and after a few moments of struggling, the officer eventually handcuffs the 10 year old several times. When the boy calmed down, the cuffs were removed. And the Denton ISD maintains that protocol was followed. They said in a statement, in this instance, the student resource officer made the determination after all other efforts to de-escalate the situation proved ineffective that the student was a detriment to his own safety and that of other students and staff. However, the parents of the 10-year-old told WFAA that the fact that their son was handcuffed was breaking a rule as they have a detailed intervention plan in place with the school, which does not permit the use of restraints. Now, the Denton Police Department said they did conduct an investigation and said it found no policy violations. Meanwhile, the boy's parents say they are considering taking legal action against both the school district and the police department. Reporting in New York, Trinity Chavez, RT. Hey YouTube, thanks for checking out our channel. We hope you enjoyed the video. We have tons of content for you just like this. For more of RT America's one-of-a-kind news and analysis, be sure to subscribe to never stop questioning more.